It's time for Big Tigger's Trending Topics on V103. Time for the Volvo 109, your favorite folks, people. We call it the Trending Topics. A lot of abuse in this particular story. A lot going on. So, did you hear? NBA young boy and female companion arrested for assaulting a housekeeper right here in Atlanta. According to reports, Kentrell Golden, better known as NBA young boy, Rested in Atlanta earlier this week along with a female companion, Star Thigpen, at the Hyatt House in downtown Atlanta. One of the hotel's housekeepers apparently entered their hotel room to clean it because she thought it was empty. Apparently, uh, NBA instructed Star to get the woman out of his room and she proceeded to punch her in the face. Fighting spilled out into the hotel hallway, allowing the housekeeper to escape and call the police. Once the authorities arrive, both arrested and charged with two counts of disorderly conduct and possession of less than an ounce of marijuana. He, NBA, released on bond on February 12th after being held in the Atlanta Detention Center. Doesn't say anything about what happened with her, but as you recall, this isn't the first time NBA has been in trouble with the law. Also indicted in 2018 for the physical abuse and felony kidnapping of his ex-girlfriend and arrested on two counts of attempted first-degree murder in 2017. Also received a suspended 10-year sentence and placed under supervised probation for three years, reportedly dating Floyd Money Mayweather's daughter, Yaya, but doesn't seem so. Story developing. All right. Shaq West, Mr. Mo Bama. Allegedly stalked and attacked Justine Sky and her friends. Wow. Justine, confirming Sheck West was abusive, says he attacked her again and followed her in two different cars full of friends. Quote, talking with my friends and my man. And Sheck West, my abuser, and his friends decided to stalk us and attack my friends. Two cars full of dudes. While he sat in the car like a little B-word. You're pathetic, Shaq, and you beat women. You hit your girl before me and you'll do it again. Wait a minute. This isn't the first time she's opened up about domestic violence. Last October, she revealed she'd been a victim of domestic violence in a previous relationship. She never detailed who abused her. She mentioned the story experience. It's one of the most scariest and heartbreaking ever. Saying she felt stupid, angry, depressed, blamed herself. Sheck West responded on social media saying, I've chosen to remain silent until now out of respect for actual victims of abuse, but I cannot stand why stand by while lives are repeatedly told about me. I never hit or beat any woman, and I did not beat up or jump anybody on Instagram Live. He made a similar statement. I never hit any woman at all. Just leave me all out of this. Apparently, the new boo is Dolly for Justine Scott. Yeah. Okay, story development. And last but not least, Kareem Hunt got a job. Fired from Kansas City after video surfaced of him kicking and pushing a woman in a hotel. Got a new contract with the Cleveland Browns. Critics of the NFL are outraged. National Organization for Women issued a statement saying the message to this sends to uh, excuse me the message that this sends is that money matters more than women. Women don't matter to the NFL, which is rather surprising while they're a big part of the viewer audience. Story developing. We'll see how this plays out. He's still up for NFL suspension, depending on how the investigation turns out. Sit for trending topics. V-103.com for more details. Big Ticket Show continues right now.